Extreme weather events are no longer uncommon. What is your position on climate change, and what is the appropriate role of the federal government to help folks and states when these disasters occur? Yeah, so uh, I, I absolutely understand that there is climate change, right? I understand that we want to all make sure that our environment and our communities are safe and flourishing and that we're not destroying it. Uh, what I think this really comes down to is energy, though. Uh, we need to really talk about energy and the fact that how it's being used and what we're doing. Because right now, uh, our economy is struggling because we're not energy independent. Look, we, we could get our economy back on track by energy being energy independent immediately. In fact, we, we've seen uh, that what we're doing right now is that we are a net import rather than a net export on oil. We're, we're, gain, we're buying more oil overseas than we are creating here. What does that do? Well, look, if we want to talk about preserving our, our climate and our environment, let's stop buying oil and gas from countries overseas that don't have the regulations that we do in the United States. We should be producing it here so we can monitor and make sure that it's clean energy. Look, my opponent and his party have been on the wrong side of this issue. They've had some of the most extreme, radical, liberal policies when it comes to energy. In fact, my opponent would support it, electric vehicle mandate. He would support a mandate that requires you to give up your gas-powered vehicles and your gas stoves for an electric vehicle that you can't afford. It would cost us a trillion dollars more in taxes to have that. In fact, we'd be given $7,500 in tax credit because China's borrowing our money or buying up our debt right now, and then we'd be given $7,500 back to him to buy a lithium battery that China, again, is creating. He talks about China being an existential threat, but he wants to give our money over to China. Look, the, the Kamala Harris-Joe Biden uh, regimen of or, uh, energy right now is not working. Uh, in fact, in the first few days of their administration, they made sure that leases couldn't be bought for oil, 